Today we're taking a look at a mug that I found at the Disney store. Yes, a mug. Welcome to I Came From A Box, my name is Sergio I.M. and yes, we are talking about a mug. Went to the mall this weekend with the family, and of course that means Riley had to go to the Disney store, and of course I ended up being the one who picked something up, and then I had to get her something, so I didn't look that bad to my wife. So I know what you're saying, a mug? Why a mug? Why a video for a mug? And I'm going to show you right now. I'm not thinking of doing more than just this video for mugs, so in case you're worried, just know that. So sadly, no box to be found, but they did wrap this in a bunch of Disney bags, which is... You know, not a box still, but anyways. So, on the bottom here we have the little Disney Store badge. Genuine, original, authentic, Marvel right there. And now let's get to the good part of course, right? So, I'm personally not the biggest fan of oddly shaped and extruded mugs, such as the ones with faces on them, like you'll have like the Hulk's face. Because then on the inside, all those dents become a pain in the butt to clean, at least for me personally. And I drink a lot of coffee that stains those things and I hate it, I can't stand it. So anyways, on here we have a bunch of classic Marvel superheroes, straight from the comics. So let's start with the first one. Here we have the Hulk jumping towards us. Then next to him we have the classic cap swinging a punch in the direction most likely of a Nazi or the Red Skull, whichever you prefer. I, I like the idea of him punching a Nazi, it's pretty funny. Then to the right we have the web crawler. That's the amazing Spider-Man web slinging right above Thor, right here, who's casually just flying by with Mjolnir right there behind Iron Man's leg. And of course that brings us over to Iron Man in his, I think it's Mark III? Mark III armor? Is like second armor maybe? I don't know. But um, they look really, really cool. I'm such a big fan of all the attention to detail on this mug too. One of the things that I really love is that behind everyone here, we have comic book panels. And they all pertain to that specific hero in this bright kind of like sharpie gray light gray and it's just an awesome background i love that they didn't keep it just black and inside i'm calling it marvel red in there so that actually makes it look that much cooler when you tilt it you see how cool that is did i just sell you on a mug guys because i sold myself on this and this is my excuse to my wife by the way <laughs> So that's our look at the Marvel Classics mug. That's not the name of it, I just, I gave it that. I think it's good, right? Anyways, I couldn't find any of these online for you guys, so you may have to do some hunting. I did find it at a local Disney store, so if you feel like looking, be careful out there, it's the holidays. So thank you so much for watching as always. If you guys like these shorter formatted videos, which I'm trying to roll out little by little, let me know what you think. Give me your thoughts, your opinions really do matter to me. And thank you so much for subscribing. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like the video or have any questions, make sure to let us know in the comments below. Now, if you want to support the channel and help us out, feel free to click that thumbs up button and subscribe for more content. Of course, if you want to follow us and interact with us, you can do so on Twitter, Facebook, and a bunch of other sites, which I'll put down below. Thank you so much. My name is Sergio I.M., and I'll see you guys for the next box.